This video will show you how to check if a copyrighted work is covered for course use through the University of St. Augustine's Blanket Copyright License. If you wish to use copyrighted work within your courses, such as handouts or readings within the course module, you will need to have the permission of the copyright holder. The University's Blanket Copyright License and the Right Find Academic Tool make this easy to check. The University pays an annual fee to procure license for faculty to share a large number of copyrighted works within the university's instructional setting. This sharing may be done as a course handout, as a chapter embedded within the course module, or as information included in a lecture presentation, just to name a few options. It's important to note that this annual license covered the use of text works only. Images are often viewed as separate works and are not covered under this blanket licensing fee. Right Find Academic is a tool provided by the Copyright Clearance Center the broker of our annual license. This tool allows you to simply search covered works. To check whether a work is covered under our annual license, you'll need to log in at Right Find Academic using a personal account at this URL. This link is also provided within the USA Library's Guide to Copyright. If you did not already have a personal account created, you can do so by clicking Register Your Account on the Right Find Academic page. After providing some basic information, including your at usa.edu email address, you'll create a password for this account and click Submit. You'll then receive an email to confirm the account setup. At that point, you can log into Right Find using your email address and the password that you created by clicking the Sign In Now button. Once you've logged in, you'll be brought to a basic search page like this one. The system should recognize the University of St. Augustine as your institution by looking at your email address. And you should see the USA logo in the upper right of the search page along with the name associated with your account. From here, you can search for any work you're interested in sharing by searching the title or ISBN or even ISSN for journals. As an example, I'm just going to search for a common physical therapy reference. Note that your results may include a list of items with different ISBN numbers, reflecting different editions. Please be sure that you're checking the license information for the correct edition that you wish to use. It's quite possible that permissions will differ between various editions. Once you've located the proper item, the box at the right will show the permissions that are covered under our blanket license. For example, you can see here that permission is licensed for both photocopying and digital sharing for this item as indicated by the green icons. Hovering or clicking on these will display a detailed list of the uses that are licensed. Again, under digital sharing, you can see that use in an electronic reserve, posting in a course management system, or on an academic intranet are all covered under this license. Likewise, for photocopy sharing, this license allows faculty to distribute work within a, within a course pack to photocopy it for classroom handouts, or to print copies for sharing with coworkers. Please also make special note of any restrictions or special terms that may limit the outlined uses. For example, this license restricts sharing to less than 10% of the entire work. Under the rights that we have purchased, that is all that is allowed. If you need to use more of a work, speak to your librarian and we may be able to make arrangements for additional license purchase. If the work you need to use is not covered, the rights page will look like this, showing that none of the digital sharing or photocopying rights are covered under this license. Please contact the librarian to assist you with other arrangements if your needs are not met by the covered uses of an item. By following the steps to check licensing status, you can safely share work in your courses without concern of infringing on the rights of a copyright holder. We hope that this tool makes it easier for faculty to check for permitted use of their copyrighted course materials. Please view the University of St. Augustine Library's Guide to Copyright for additional information and links. There's also a handout available on this page with the instructions covered in this video. If you have any questions about the Right Find Academic License, about copyright in general, or need assistance identifying additional license material, you can always contact the librarian at library at usa.edu.